Greetings, programs. This is Wretch, and welcome back to Crisis Core Final Fantasy VII Reunion. And in the last stream, guys, um, things, the stakes definitely did rise. Zach um, visited the town, the hometown of both Genesis and Angeal, and um, we saw Angeal's mother. Um, we found her dead later, apparently Angeal's doing. Genesis now has a black wing, like Sephiroth's one wing angel form. And uh, yeah, things are definitely not good in the world of Soldier. And Zack's now kind of wrestling with the idea that Soldiers, at least the first class Soldiers, are monsters. So we are back here at base, and uh, we've been talking to the lovely Professor Hojo. We've been doing some simulations with him. So let's see what happens here. The ultimate virtual data. Are you interested? Sure. We're gonna fight Brett Spiner in his final form. Hey, I'm warning you. Don't do this. That program is way too dangerous. I agree. It may cost you your life. I'm not exaggerating. It's all right, we saved. <laughs> you are indeed a sample worthy of my attention. You need not worry. I will see to it that your remains contribute greatly to science. Now, my precious virtual data, prove my greatness to the entire world. I hope they put our head in a jar like in Futurama. And we fought this beastie, whoa, at the beginning of the game. What do we got? Ow. Hi. Astounding. This is most unexpected. Wait. Hmm. I formulated a new hypothesis. The prettier the hair, the more dangerous a soldier. Uh, you were saying something about my remains? Yes. My knowledge, ability, and inspiration have forged a new path. You and I will share a special relationship. <laughs> Did you hear me? <laughs> nope, he's in science land. Yes, my knowledge, ability. You and I will share. Lunch first. Right, Suzanne? I didn't think anyone could beat that program. You must be some kind of monster. No, something even more terrifying. That's probably not what Zack needs to hear right now. Unbelievable! A human being beat that data? That's impossible, even for Soldier. Could it be a bug in the emulator? Don't let any of the big companies know you're using an emulator. They don't take kindly to it. All right, um, I think we went ahead and explored most of the stuff. Always lunch first, yes, it's a sound, sound advice. Um, I know we already went to the materia room. You know Angel's mother? She used, I think, for the- We already talked to all of these guys. We'll go ahead and check and see what missions um, we need to do. Ooh. At least lunch if you're feeling frisky dinner too. Ever since the Wu Tai War ended, 
Director Lazard has been permanently holed up in the director's office. Must be doing paperwork or something. If you want to go to the director's office, take the elevator. And it doesn't seem like the rest of Soldier is sweating um, Angeal and Genesis's defection. Maybe because they think they still have Sephiroth in the ranks. Do you really think you can hack it in Soldier the way you are now? Do you really think you can hack it in Soldier the way you are now? Sorry, sir. Soldier third class. You don't seem to get the most important thing about being a soldier member. You better think on it. What's going on? You're not a familiar face. Are you a rookie third class? I'm Zach, by the way, yeah? Yes. I just joined Soldier last month. I do like I do like the fact that Zack like introduces himself to like the lower rank soldiers and like, "Hi, I'm Zack. How are you?" You know, kind of thing. It's it's very wholesome. But it's like I can't do anything right. I seem to only get in other people's way. That's why he was just yelling at me. Hey now. You're Soldier. Don't give up so easily. But he said I'd be thrown out if I screw up the next mission. I think I just don't have what it takes. Ah, oh, come on. You made it this far, right? Come on. I know. Rally, rally. What? You're so wishy-washy. Tell you what. I'll go on your next mission for you. What? You do that? Just keep it quiet. Watch what I do out there and learn from it, okay? Yes, I'll try. So from what I've learned here, looking at everyone, uh, mission number M7-11, is when you're soldier, like third class or second class, you have to wear these helmets. And then when you show that you can be more individual, they start calling you more by your first name. You get to take off the helmet and then they give you your like honorary uh, like bottle of conditioner and bottle of hair gel and say, get after it. That's what I kind of want to see. Zach is a D&D &D bard. That is a great shout. Okay, Genesis's forces, Hojo's laboratory, or laboratory, because that's where scientists like calling it, or evil scientists at least, seeking priceless items, and Zack the Materia Hunter. A secret makeover montage. I'm sure Cloud would love hearing about that. Enemy on the march. Foes on the waterfront. Coast Guard has spotted Genesis's troops, so they're likely to have an outpost near the coast. Head there and vanquish the enemy. Let's go. Oh, we got two chests to open. Activating combat mode. Out of the way. Puppers! We're getting some decent money for that. There you are. You just have to have your makeover montage at the Honey Bee Inn. Um, now nah, we should be fine. Ow. That's rude. Bronze bangle. A few more bangles and we'll be able to start a band. All right, um, yeah, that works.
massive machines. We receive reports of Genesis troops hiding large-scale weapons in the caves, destroy them, and stop their advance. You need Zack cross-dressing in your life? I'm... I'm sure you can find it. I bet you good money an absolute ton exists. Um, since we're dealing with machines, let's go ahead... Thunderblade... And my, we need to level up Dark Thunder. One treasure chest to be found. Activating combat mode. Later. Conflict resolved. Ding. Remedy. Activating combat mode. Take that. Complete oh, yeah. One thing that's really good about these training missions is we start to encounter another bangle. We start to encounter like enemies that we haven't met in the main game yet, so when they do show up, they're not nearly as intimidating, because we know how to deal with them. It's like actual legit kind of training. Okay, we're done with Genesis's forces. Sample monsters. Bahamut. So it's our rematch, huh? A rare find indeed. I thank you for such an invaluable sample. I've created another battle simulation based on this data, so you have it once you're ready. The thing about the interesting thing about Bahamut is we're able to deal with him so quickly. Like in Final Fantasy X, Bahamut is like the most powerful summon you can get in the game without unlocking any of the, the secret. Like Aeons. Ow! Come here. Ooh. Um. Heal. Thank you. Again. So much cure. We're fine. I don't think lightning was it. I don't think he has any elemental weaknesses. He's just a pain. Yep. Resolved. Yeah, if I remember my FF10 right, amulet. Um. Bahamut was the most powerful summon you could get other than the Maga Sisters and Anima. If memory serves. Um. Okay. We have items in the planes. Which is a rank 5. Don't want to do that yet. Seeking priceless items, recall missions. A Shinra freight carrier has sunk near Medil. 
Some of its cargo is drifted to a desert island in the area, and the last thing we want is anti-Shinra elements procuring that cargo. Go there and retrieve what is ours. Yeah, you gotta love a good retrieval mission. Nothing goes wrong during those. Go get this rare gemstone. Hey, go retrieve the president's daughter. Smooth sailing the entire way. Are you over? Ah. Almost as awesome as escort missions. You know, I don't mind escort missions in games, but my eye twitches a little bit just because I remember the escort missions in World of Warcraft, like before Wrath of the Lich King, during Burning Crusade and Vanilla, were brutal. Activating combat mode. Conflict resolved. I love we're continuing to fight machines. Thank you so much, Zach. That was amazing. I learned so much from you. Hey, that's the spirit. So you're ready to take on the next mission yourself? Oh, Lord, no. Hmm, well, knowing how I am, I'll probably screw something up again. Maybe I should write to Mom and Pa back home. Tell them how cold city life can be. Go ahead and write to Ma and Pa, but don't tell him that. Ah, fine. I'll do your next mission too. You will. Ah. Zach's that guy in the class that wants everyone to do well. Like I'll answer some of them. Black Market Recall. Certain Shinra brand accessories were being traded illegally in the slum marketplace. The employee responsible has already been arrested, but some of the accessories are still hidden in the slums. Go there and recover all of the accessories. Yeah, I'm... I get pretty paranoid about that based on the game. I think it comes from doing so many, like, um, YouTube series where, um, right, hold on one sec. Where you get so used in certain games to having an autosave feature, and then you play a game, and then you completely forget, maybe because it's like an indie game, or made from a company that doesn't normally do autosaving, and then you realize you got a lot of catch-up to do. Oh, there you are. So I'd rather over-save than under-save. Hey, Psycho! Activating combat mode. Oh, yeah, friends. Man. Oh yeah. Thank you, Professor Zach. Amazing as always. You're a great reference. Got upgraded to Professor First Class, Soldier Second Class. You must be ready now. Go on the next mission yourself, okay? You're right, yes. I can't argue with you, Professor Zack. So choose between these three starting Pokemon and leave me alone with your mother for 20 years. Yes, you can do it. You're in Soldier. Be confident. Do me a favor. Bury my body on top of a hill with a view. Like John Marston? Duh. Come on! All right then, but this is the last time. Much obliged. I'm so sorry. Oh, that's a reference. That's a reference to the uh, Pokemon cartoon, Messy. Professor Oak was like, "Here, Ash, choose your Pokemon, and then go off and try and be a Pokemon trainer for 20 years." 
while I hang out with your mom. Because that's exactly what he did. Cargo recall. Oh, the berry on the hill thing? Uh, Red Dead Redemption. Our cargo stolen by an anti shin a cargo recall. Cargo stolen by an anti Shinra element has been found inside the plate. The organization was neutralized, but an AI weapon glitch prevented us from reclaiming our precious cargo. We have no use for malfunctioning machines. Destroy them and collect our goods. Diamond gloves. I don't think we've had diamond gloves before. Hey, welcome back, Tay. Whoa. These guys have... They have the one wing too? That's new. I mean, they are Genesis clones, so I guess they would have that ability to create the ring the wings and well but holy crap sprint shoes activating combat mode Got it. oh yeah lots of spare parts At least all they do is throw knives. All right, hello there. Activating combat mode. Let's dance. There we go. Oh, yeah. You're incredible, Zach. It's been such an education. You better be taking notes. Oh, he's um soldier third class level four now, though. So, what about the next mission? This is like um an MMO when you adopt a newbie. Yes, the next mission. I'll be doing it myself. Ah! So you're finally up for it. But, truth be told, I'd like to see you in action one last time. <sighs> That's a lot of last times. <laughs> You've become such a great role model for me, Zach. You're the kind of operative that I want to be. Well, now you're making me blush. Okay, if that's how you feel, I'll help you out. That's actually a good way to stretch out your arms and your back muscles. You're the best, Zach! Also, one of the best ways I found to um, take off chainmail armor. If you're wearing like a long chainmail shirt, you hike it up a little bit, and then you do exact Zach's pose there when he's frustrated, where his arms are just hanging. And then you start rolling your shoulders, and the chain mill will just slide off. All right. Um. There's two more missions. You're lying to me. The chain mill shimmy. Mm-hmm. Soldier supplies that went missing, along with stocks of Shinra weapons, have been found in the wasteland. Genesis troops have also been spied in the area. Go to the site and collect all supplies. Was the movie thumbs up or thumbs down, Tay? Now that you've seen the whole thing. Activating combat mode. You again. Oh yeah! 
a G Commando. Well, where the heck are all the treasure chests at? Very much a thumbs up. Excellent. That's what I like to hear. Oh, actually, we need to see what the... Okay, what's Sprint shoes? Sprint 20, Prevent Stop. Um, Vitality and Spirit, Prevent Silence, which we already have. Force Bracelet, Diamond Gloves. Attack and Magic plus 10, Prevent Silence. Ooh. Those Diamond Gloves are, are better than what we had. Um... Vitality and Spirit. Everything prevents silence. It's interesting. Let's go with... We're going to lose 5, but we're going to gain 30% HP. Titanium Bangle and Diamond Gloves. To the moon. Activating combat mode. Conflict resolved. Got him. Much obliged, boss man. What I learned from you can't be learned in a classroom. <laughs> His voice go went from like high pitched and teenage, and now he's starting to talk like uh, Jensen uh, Eccles, I think his name is from Supernatural. Boss man Zach, I swear I'll never forget what you did for me. Yeah, uh, you certainly toughened up, huh? Oh, you know it, boss. <laughs> it sounds just going on the next mission. And I'm going to show everyone who's boss, boss. Wait, are you really the same guy? Boss man, see you later. Yeah. He's drunk the, the Kool-Aid. A pearl necklace. Do, 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 do. It's easy top song. Oh, okay. Well, that's kind of disconcerting that we're creating this killing machine to send out into the world. Deputy Assignment. A soldier third class was sent alone to reclaim cargo stolen by Genesis's troops. He came back injured and dejected and has been pulled out of action. Please head to the site and collect the cargo. All right. It's rank four. Let's see if we can pull this off. Oh, there we go. Doesn't look like they like the lizard. Or at least the doggies didn't. Blizzara obtained. Activating combat mode. Conflict resolved. Oh yeah. Well, wait a minute. We didn't equip. Blizzard. Oh, that's why. Uh, Dark Blizzard. Where's Dark Blizzard at? There they are. I just derped it up. Was all. Activating combat mode. Cut. 
No fin kick for you. We're going to need to heal probably at the start of the next engagement. Lovely. Me thrill gloves. Activating combat mode. Conflict resolved. Oh yeah. You're lucky, I almost was able to summon Bahamut, or excuse me, Ifrit. Can't go across that bridge. All right. So, dealing with another mechanical. I need to level up this Dark Thunder. It is just not wanting to cooperate. Ow, hey. Oh, you'd hate. Never mind. We did a bad. I made an assumption and pay I'm paying for it. Rude. My thanks, Master Zack. An impressive display, as always. It's too bad about that last mission. Well, happens to us all. <laughs> my inexperience impacted my performance. Practice always trumps theory on the field of battle. All right there. When did you turn to the Zhu Leong? No, oh, I thought you might be feeling down, but you're taking it well. Master Zack, I will show you one day the power I've gained under your tutelage. Are we going to have to fight him next? Uh, yeah. Good day, sir. Yep. Uh, who created a monster? What have we done? Last one. Second deputy assignment. This is an emergency situation. Shinra accessories have been stolen by Genesis troops that infiltrated the plate. They are apparently too tough for the soldier third class operatives we sent in. You must go there and get back the accessories. Okay, rank four. We can do this. We need to check and see if they're still blizzard troops, though. Or blizzard susceptible. Ooh, the entire area is open and f open for us to explore. Hey, Bart, what's going on, buddy? Activating combat mode. Oh, that's a lot of bombs! Holy crap! Don't you think it's about time you use that sword of yours? This sword is heavy and unwieldy. Then why don't you bring a lighter one? 
Four months over. Prove your honor to me. I got it. Psycho Crusher! Yeah, I think so, but I think Cloud even is aware of it. This game is supposed to answer a lot of questions. Okay, um... I don't know. We're gonna see what happens here. I'm trying to avoid the combat. Um, we definitely want to go this way. Well, I'm glad you're taking it easy, Bart. I am too. Miss style obtained. Ooh. We'll save all of our oomph for the boss. Hug the walls in the meantime. But I think it's pretty much anything, like, once you start developing the muscle memory. Bart and I have seen that um, in LARP on multiple occasions. People using, like, the heaviest, most unwieldy weapons. When people keep on telling them to use stuff that's lighter. And then when they, they're stubborn and start using that exclusively. But then they can get actually pretty you know, pretty adept at it over time. All right. The Shredder. <laughs> yes, mini cloud swords. All right. Let's see if I am doing the right thing here. I don't think it's a blizzard. I think it's electric. Activating combat mode. Sweet Jesus. Hey, leveled up that Thunderblade. Let's go. Oh, we nulled physical. Missiles don't count as physical. First try, no deaths. Cleared M16 secu- Okay, report to soldier third class in the briefing room. Cool. From your experience, who sp everyone who spins their swords around and attempts all kinds of acrobatics are usually an easy kill. Very much so. Uh, Bart can tell you the thing that always annoyed me, I didn't get an, well, no, I got annoyed a lot, but the only thing that, one of the few things that would make me like legit angry, other than getting hit in the face, is if someone ran and jumped at me. And then it was like, all right, someone's getting power bombed. <laughs> I guess I'm no good after all. Okay, his voice is back to normal. What happened? I was on steroids, sir. 
Even after you taught me all that stuff, I still keep screwing up all the time. I guess I just don't have what it takes to be a soldier. Hey, come on. What happened to all that confidence you had before? I've decided to quit soldier and go back home. Oh, is this the guy who was actually talking with the deep voice? I heard you're quitting soldier. Oh, this is the guy from before. Yes. I'm sorry for everything. Did you find out the most important thing for soldier? No, I never did. But I know what kept me going until today. I wanted to become a great operative like Zack one day. Duh. That was the dream that kept me going. <laughs> when I was a rookie, my mentor always told me. Go fetch me a coffee. Embrace your dreams. Dreams? My mentor, like Zack, used to help me on my missions. Wait a minute. Could your mentor be... The most important thing about being a soldier... ...is to embrace your dreams. My mentor taught me that. Oh. Embrace my dreams. All right, we got premium tires. <laughs> and he's doing Hindu squats. I'm embracing my dreams. Embracing the burn. I've decided to stay in soldier a while longer so I can become an operative like you. My first goal is squats. I'm hoping to do over a thousand of them eventually. Makes my knees hurt just looking at it. Yeah, I remember when I bolt chipmunk over. I was a miserable sod around that time, but that was one time I did use my powers for good. I feel. Okay, we are rocking and rolling here. Um, we just have one more. Zack the Materia Hunter. Rematch with Ifrit. Clash with Genesis troops. We received word that Genesis troops are currently transporting precious materia they had shamelessly pilfered from Shinra. We take the security of our materia seriously, so go get it back. It was a good laugh. That was a good day. And all it took was someone getting completely humbled. At least for that day. <laughs> Activating combat mode. Take that. Conflict resolved. Oh yeah. Okay. Um. One chest. Eh. Don't care. Let's just do it. Do the thing. More materia. Rematch with Bahamut. Oh, we get the Bahamut. Oh, yes. Gimme. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Activating combat mode. Hey, big guy. Rude. Four months over. Eat hellfire. Ah. 
Oh, we're good. We're good. <laughs> oh, God, no flare. God bless. Oh, missed it. Gotcha. We got the Bahamut Materia. Cool. Ooh. New, more new stuff? Escape from Hojo's lab. A monster has escaped from Hojo's laboratory. The monster has been powered up by materia and must be captured at any cost. Hunt it down and take its materia after it has been subdued. Who is the critter? Hello? Oh, is it a chocobo? Oh, it's a manual. Okay, you don't like fire. Later. Oh yeah. All right. Well, if you don't like fire, we will grab that. Hello. Level 19! Not a chocobo. It would have played the theme. Oh, I didn't see any new mission. That might have been it. Oh, nope. Mystery Materia. We detected a strong materia reaction in the caves, its source is unknown, as there appears to be no presence of Genesis copies or Wutai remnants. No Mako eruptions have been reported either, so conduct an investigation immediately. We can get Odin. Cool. We've never fought Odin. This should be interesting. Oh god. Okay. Um. Guess we'll go this way. Hug the walls. Everything's good. So do we not have to fight Odin? We just get the materia if we do a good job? Activating combat mode. I mean, I'm okay with that. For a plethora of reasons. What in God's name are you?
that looks like the physical manifestation of my appetite. Um... Okay, we'll do dark fire with... Maybe... Uh, let's do jump. Activating combat mode. What's your store? Oh, he's hungry. <laughs> oh, he hurts. He hurts badly. He's got a... He got a spell called bile. <laughs> Can you not? Got him. Ooh. Odin Materia! Sick. Okay, well, we've gotten two new summons doing these missions here. To hell and back, huh? An abnormal electromagnetic... Okay, that's a uh, rank 5. I think we're going to leave that alone for right now. And that's a rank 5. And we still have this stupid thing that we haven't been able to get through yet. We're going to... We're going to try. Every stream, we're going to... Let's see if we got enough damage to take this guy down. Okay. This guy is just beefed up to... Okay. It's not horrible. They have a cave troll. Activating combat mode. Oh man, he's still doing like half of my health with a backhand. Oh, I was on the oh Yep. I'm out of range. Ah! Not yet. <laughs> Getting there. Not yet. So I guess we are done with everything in here. Let's go talk to the boss. Hey, Zack. So, the war is over. That it is. I'm sure you heard. I ruled. No, I didn't hear. The company reports don't mention you at all. On TV, they only talk about Sephiroth's bravery. But Sephiroth was in B unit. Well, our heroes are chosen by the media. Dreams crushed and the shampoo and conditioner companies useful summon oh obtain the bahamut materia oh we already did that 
And obtain the Odin Materia. Good. We were ahead of the email curve. Oh, come on. Cheer up, will ya? No. Exhibit room entrance. I don't know. Like, guys, should we go ahead and join one of the fan clubs? I know we still were talking about that before. We've got the Genesis fan club, the Angeal fan club. Actually, not a fan of any of them right now. <laughs> Alright. Well, I also want to see if there's anything other interesting that's popped up between missions. Including you. Right now, we are running a special on potions. Yeah, out of all of the ones, I would just want to learn to play. For no other reason that it may give us more insight on a way to beat Genesis. The general public still has to pay full price. How about you, sir? Would you like one? Drink this lovely monster zero energy. Thank you, friend. All right, are you all nothing new? Oh, we should see if the if the uh, train has arrived. Hey, Mr. Soldier, let me ask you something. Have you ever met a dandy gentleman who rides a black chocobo? Is this up there with, have you ever was it Dance with the Devil in the Pale Moonlight? A gentleman on a black chocobo. Have we seen a gentleman on a black chocobo? You haven't, huh? I guess he's not that well known. The other day, I went to Kong and was attacked by monsters along the way. You've heard that monsters are running amok around Midgar and Kong, haven't you? Well, that's when he saved me. The man on the black chocobo. He was so dashing. Much more heroic than, say, your average soldier grunt. Okay, mission has been given. We may need to go to encounter this uh, dashing hero. So it does pay to come back here to see if there's anything new. Okay, we already talked to you. Fan club's back here. I can't believe that Genesis was killed in action. Rest in peace, my sweet prince. It's tragic. Your search for the true meaning of the loveless text will be carried on by we in the study group. You, sir. How about you? Would you like to study Genesis's Bible Loveless with the study group? Sure. I mean, if I don't agree with you here, you'll just go door to door. Welcome. You are now a fellow worshipper of Loveless. As long as it's not the bad guy from Wild Wild West. Oh, it looks like you've got new mail. Why don't you take a look? We have deducted X amount of gill from your account. Declaration. The reason Genesis adored Loveless so much, he claimed it provided answers to so many of the mysteries in our world regarding history, science, art, and astronomy. But experts agree that the answer to the biggest mystery was in the final act, which was scattered and lost, and is thus worthy of further study. Our dear Genesis also devoted his life to interpreting the missing final act. As a devoted study group, let's inherit his life's work in his memory. 
Genesis Girls. Okay, well. Loveless is an epic poem from the days of old, whose final act has never been discovered. Therefore, literary experts always get into heated debates about their interpretations of the final act. I was deeply affected by Genesis's interpretations. You could say my personal passion for Loveless was ignited by Genesis. Uh-huh. Great. <laughs> Suzanne, it's a cult! 